Hello guys, welcome back to another video. Today, you will notice, I am playing Gmod, or Gary Mod, and super duper contributor, computer, newbie at this. Oh man, this is not that I wanted. I think it's not that I wanted, very good. Oh, okay. Okay, let's hope this works. Uh, Action, I don't really see. Okay, so here is a little map thing, but I am probably not going to show you what I'm doing right about now. Let me just get something first. Uh, okay. That was glitchy almost. Now. Okay, then. Uh, oh, this is really spooky right now. I guess we're gonna do it there. I'm actually gonna do it over there because it's kind of a better explainer in the degree thing in the dig there. So, load, 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 load. Okay, we just switched maps twice because I am super nubular at this and I don't get the screen. Okay, here's the TARDIS. It's amazing. Here is the interior. It is epic. Now, if you've seen Dr. Who, you know what this is, TARDIS. But if you haven't, you should you should literally stop the video and go watch it right now. Right now. Do it now. 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 Now do it now. Go. Go. I'm just gonna do it until my two minutes up. Now. Go. 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 Go, go. Okay, so TARDIS, time and relative space. And it's locked. Okay. Uh the reason my sonic screwdriver is the eleventh, but I modify it so it's blue. Wait, you know. I'm gonna a flashlight here so I can show you what it is. So it's blue. Yeah, I modified it like that, so uh let's have some now we have some programmable flight mode. Which I can't figure out how to use. Um there's a lot of stuff with the level is how you lock it and unlock it. Uh uh it's useless in single player. This is how you get into this camera mode thingy. Timer and handbrake, I don't know what that does long flight puzzle, I have no idea. This, no. This, this is the fast return thing. Fast return to it. The TARDIS is visible. This is when, you know how when the TARDIS flies and like spins? You can set it to clockwise, anti-clockwise, or just counterclockwise, or it doesn't spin at all. Navigation mode is just nothing. Uh, we got power here. Locking down mechanism. Uh, uh, I'm not sure what that does in a minute. A hostile action display in the system, or HAD. And then flight mode. And then you just press E on the console. And then W. And then W. And then R to deactivate and R. You to deactivate and Then you can just press E and you can get out of it and you can lock the camera over there. Or you can do a lot of damage and I'll do that here. Physical lock is a good thing. That is, in a lot of things, you can't do anything. It would do it straight down. But sometimes it might fall on its side. In order to fix that, you just pull this lever. And then it puts it on its like I'll show you. Okay. okay, that's better. See, and the camera has like facing the sun, you just go like this. And then it kind of the camera out, and then. Whoosh! You unpull it. It might take a while, you know, to get around a bit. And the other side is the corner. The corner is showing the weight of the things. And it's going to drop. But yes. The self 
prepared. I'm actually just going to show you what happens if the health drops to zero. I could use the wizard number. Oh god. Oh god. No clip. So. Uh, it's done. Drag it around and stuff. Oh, I died. Oh, the tide just killed me. It fell on me. Uh, I dropped the tennis out. Oh, there. Got you. Okay, this is what it looks like. I'm not going to fight now. This is totally crazy. So, you know what? We're going to go inside. Oh, you missed on a sonic screwdriver. <laughs> so, you had the cluster bell going off. Power is off. Let's make a very pleasant way. Oh, oh, oh. Uh, Geronimo! And then splat. You're actually softening the line this time. Okay, so in order to fix it up, I'm going to have to undo the whole thing. You just need to use the uh, self-repair lever right here. Okay, then you just exit. And then it just tells you how long it's going to take. So, while that's going, why don't we just talk about a little bit about fairies now? It is a game that, in order to get to work, well, you need total or counter-strike score. You've got a variety of guns and stuff here. The TARDIS is an add-on. You can download those. Like, uh, this stuff where it's done. I got the dark blue. You can need to hold Q down. Options. No, 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 no. It's C. Uh, player model. That's how, that's how I look. I am not know. It's kind of a creepy look. But then you just do colors. Side gun color, and then you can change the color up. It's fun. And then you basically go push and go Hey, he's, he's back now. Oh, I blew it up again. <laughs> How do I blow up the TARDIS after it's done? Alright, so... Again, again, I blew it back up. I blew up the TARDIS. Yep, that's how it works. Grenade, RPG, tool gun, color. The TARDIS is perfect. <laughs> like a lightning Okay, hold on, let me just get like a crate or something. Sure. Oh, that's not going to work. Uh, 
back to the terminal though. They were on top of that building. Oh, wait. 